How is it looking if I turn it on? Okay, it looks okay. That is now okay. Hello guys, and welcome back to some more Frostpunk uh, Extreme Difficulty. Where I uh, get my people very hurt and then they might die. And uh, let's hope they won't. I, I, I believe in my, my extreme skills that totally fit Extreme Difficulty. And look at that, we have a lot of food now. It was actually our big problem, or one of our biggest problems for a little while there. Uh, a lot of people were dying because they didn't get enough food. But for now, it seems like that worry is somewhat no longer there. Uh, yeah, I, I'm in need of more people, and the only way to get those would be to actually create the um, the beacon. I wanted to get more stuff done before I did so. But it seems like I might not be able to have enough people for everything. I can get the kids to work, I suppose, but then I'm gonna have problems with them getting hurt all the time. Moonshine? Every meal slightly lowers discontent. Eating soup causes less discontent. Oh, I mean, that's not that useful then. That's also more discontent. Uh, child labor, old jobs. They can die and, and get injured, but only if it's something that seems dangerous. I don't think there's anything I need um, in that regard. I guess I want the care house. Hear me, hear me. Coal pile depleted, that one's done. Okay, let's go ahead and build... Uh, what can I build? The cow house? 25 wood and 5 steel. Uh, okay, that's manageable, I would say. Uh, coal pile gone and depleted. Okay, so this doesn't even make sense to have anymore. There we go. Let's put kids in there and let's put more workers in there. We need that wood. We need it now. Uh, work overtime. That would be great if you would. Please do so. I need one worker in there, actually. I just needed to function. Okay, hope rises. That's good. People now have a place to uh, to be there. Just get less sick and um, do do better. I, I don't. I'm not a great motivational person, but uh, that's totally how it works. I'm gonna get cold again now. Can't say I'm a big fan of that. Can now reach tier one technologies. I want to unlock the other stuff, so I'm actually going to have to pick this one now. I will have to get the stuff to go. Um, I, otherwise, I'm just going to freeze to death slowly. Get to work. Move, we didn't get a lot of food that time? It's so weird. <laughs> Why is it so random? Keep going, people. Keep going. The shift is ending. That's going to go one up, and then we're going to go two down. That's my guess, anyway. At least we're getting quite a lot of wood. Okay, new law. What can we get? What can we get? I guess prosthetics? I mean, I'm getting all of these quite early. 
Moonshine, sure, you know what? It doesn't require anything and, and if it works, it works. Okay, 20 food. I need to build a care house. Uh, care house, where do I put it? I guess I need to put it somewhat close by. Let's put it here, just so it is somewhat close by. I also need to build that now. And another medical post, I suppose, wouldn't hurt. Just temporarily. Or maybe it would hurt. I don't want to spread out my engineers too much. Could I even put this out here? <laughs> Is that even possible? I'm gonna blob it down over here. Uh, more power, resources. I mean, I guess resources would be super useful. Wall drill, steelworks. I don't really have a way to get steel. Steelworks, sure. Uh, just so I can get steel somehow. End of shift. You, you don't function without that, okay. We need people! We need a lot of people! I have one, two, three, and that's not enough. <coughs> wow. People from our convoy. I mean, if they if they stop dying, that would also be great. People coming back from the hunt with food. Coal pile depleted. Where? Actually. Please finish the beacon. I would love to finish it now. That would be so lovely. That would be great. That would be so, so great. Great efficiency. Beacon build. We're no longer lost and blind. From now on, our people can do something, something. We shall guide our people. Okay. Rescue survivors from Lost Expedition. Right now, uh, how many do I need to make a team again? I need five people. Ooh, five people. What can I take them away from? And food is very necessary. Uh, we need a win, yes. Yes, we do need a win. Doesn't mean we will get one, though. I need five free people and... Uh... That's four, and then I'll take one more, I suppose. Uh... Wait, I, I should have five workers, no? No, I don't. Wait, didn't I just take a couple... Oh, no, I only took... Okay. And then I need a lot of wood. It isn't, isn't that kind of ironic? I just removed them from wood duty. I need 40 wood. Get 40 wood and I'll take them from there. Okay.
The dark cave entrance visible to the hillside. We think we saw a faint source of smoke coming from it. Um, sure, let's go over there first. Inoperative. Is there really anything else I want? I mean, prosthetics would be nice, but I can't use it. Child labor, old jobs. I'm gonna go ahead and get that one. Listen, uh, this will end with the child dying at work. Mark my words. No, I'm not. I'm not planning on making the kids work dangerous jobs. Edwin, Emma, better. Hugo died. Oh no. This is one of the named characters that died. I think that might even be the first time that has happened. You can see everything is kind of cold. Uh, but Chili is still okay. It's over here where we need to worry. So, in other words, when it gets cold. After this, if it gets below minus 40, we are, we, we are in trouble. We also have two hours until those guys arrive. Okay, there we go. Gloomy cave. Uh, survivors, explore. Um, beset by beasts, we can hear terrified shrieks coming from the cave uphill. When we come closer, several polar bears run towards us, block the entrance. Um, risk attacking the bears. People in the cave will live. Scouts will escort them to our city if they survive. It's, there's a lot of people, though. Is that 19 engineers? That's worth it. That's definitely worth it. Bad to help the survivors. When our scouts attack the bears, the people in the cave uh, join them and together they throw the beasts away. Unfortunately, the scouts died from their injuries. The people um, they saved set out towards our city guided with the map made by the scouts. I, I don't actually know. Is this, like, guaranteed to happen? Because this happened before as well. Like when I played before. I lost five people to gain more, pretty much. Uh, the sawmill will probably get the kids hurt, so I can't make them do sawmill work. Yeah, I have to get the hot house. Um, I really have to get it. Just more people. That also works. Twenty-five wood for the steel works. A two, I suppose. Wall drill not very important right now. Hot house very very important. I need twenty wood. Give me 20 wood, please. Actually, maybe not. I still need 20 wood, though. Medical post upgrade. Coal thumper is nice, but I... I don't need it at the moment. Yeah, medical post upgrade is, is my go-to right now. That's something I need. 10% faster is huge. Time to rest, folks. Works out today. Okay, great, great. So... Um... Yeah. 21. 21 being treated. The people have arrived! Hello, people! How are you doing? Welcome! Did you at least bring the buddies with you? I'm just kidding. It's okay, we can face them later. <laughs> people from our convoy reunions. It's heartwarming to see families reunited after so many hardships, but shouldn't there be other settlements nearby? The first expedition left London long ago. Got to be well established by now. They'll surely help us find our footing. We will look for others. Now we should be able to make another team. After we get 40 wood. A lot of engineers. 
exactly what I'm hoping for. Uh, what is this? Survivors reach the city, so a group of survivors reach our city. Uh, they are tired, they'll need a place to rest, a bite to eat, so on and so forth. So I need to build two homes for them. Um, could you guys please work first? Like, could you go into places and kind of do your thing? Prosthetics, child labor, all jobs. Um, house of pleasure. I don't think I need that one. Prosthetics, sure. Let's go ahead and do that. Hear me, hear me. New law in the city. Wait, why are so many people not working there? Get to work. Move, people. There's plenty to do. I'll clearly build tents for you, but I need to have you guys actually work first. Well, that's a bit of a painful spot. I mean, here I can put it. Because I have nowhere else to put the kids, so I'm gonna put them in there. Don't know if it's gonna make a difference, but... Yeah, I need the hot house. I, I thought I didn't need it after what I saw, but... Uh, I want to address this right now. Okay, let's make another house right there. And all you have to do is just kind of plop. There we go. Um, steel is not necessary at the moment. Sawmill is doing fine. Food. Another hunter's hut would probably be a good idea. Oh, it can even be all the way out here. I mean, sure, why not? Just remove it if I don't need it anymore. You guys are indeed working overtime. Yes, okay. Another sawmill would actually be great. So building it here wouldn't hurt any resources, right? So I can build it right there. And then I can make you go... Uh, or whatever, never mind. Okay, so I pretty much need you guys to hunt during nighttime. And then go work during daytime. Oh, no. Go get this, kids. Temperature falls. Cold is coming. Work, Work over time. I really need you to do that. I don't care if you get sick. Engineers, you can go do this. At least until I fix this up. What is this all about? Hello there. Man from Winterhome. We found an exhausted man at the edge of the city. He said he came to from Winterhome, a settlement located not far from here, and that he was the last survivor. Winterhome is dead. Everyone is dead. There's no hope for survival in this accursed wasteland. You're all doomed. You must escape. These are his last words. He wasn't one of our people. We are alone. We should never have left Britain. No, people, don't give up. You should have used to stay in London. Surely you couldn't have fallen like this. Terribly, all the poor people. We can't end up like them. How are we supposed to survive if they didn't? With, with willpower alone, of course. 
When the home has fallen, they're all dead. How will we survive here without any help? We have to go back to London. There's no hope for us here in this frozen desert. People start gathering news for the threat of winter home spreads through the city. Some of them want to drop everything and flee to London. Panic is starting to set in. Oh, are we going to go with Faith this time? Faith is a bit more powerful in my opinion. I, I went with Order and Discipline first time I played this. Uh, but Faith and Spiritual Strength seems to actually have the most powerful benefits. Uh, people are shaken, wrecked by fear and doubt. They lost hope in the chance of survival. Desperation quickly could quickly push them to commit reckless acts. You have to unite them behind a vision, a vision of the future. Decide what will give them purpose and restore hope, or else our city will descend into the chaos that consume Winterhome. Uh, House of Prayer, I guess, sure. New law. A new law has passed. Medical post upgrade, that's great. Uh, next up, Hot House. Whenever I get... I mean, I need wood for a lot of stuff right now. Hot house, hot house, hot house, not bunk house, hot house. Uh, the unconvinced want to leave. Sir, you've convinced the majority, but hope is low. A group of our people still so scared they want to flee from the city for London in 15 days. They've come to try to change your mind. You say the faith will save us? Nonsense. What are we going to pray for food and, uh, when we start to leave? When we start to starve? Shouts one of them. If we don't try to reach London, we'll end up like winter home. Is London any better? Your London people are divided. Some of them are so scared that they plan to leave the city for London in 15 days. They'll try to convince others to join them, um, preying on their discontent. Fear may lead people to desperate acts. Maintain peace, give people hope, and manage the discontent to guide the city to sa uh, city safely through the looming social crisis. Oh, hello there, Londoners. I need more people. That is what I need. I also need more coal, apparently. Because right now I'm kind of getting more than I'm losing, but I still only have like 18 left. There's 30 wood and 10 steel. Frostbite. Isn't that one of the kids? <laughs> uh oh. At least we have some food. A bit dangerous. Tad bit dangerous indeed. Work day ends. It's off time. I mean, temperature is not changing, so that's nice. But it doesn't change the fact that I need to, uh, need to get more coal. I guess coal thumpers are next on the agenda. Again, more people. People join the Londoners. So the people who want to leave for London have successfully urged friends and neighbors to join them. People are more easily persuaded because they have little hope in our ultimate survival. I don't really blame them, but at the same time, you know, you don't really try. Or they haven't even tried yet. We'll have to build two of these. Let me send an expedition first. There's some people that I need to... Um, food is not exactly the best thing to sacrifice here, but... Um, there are people here. I need more people. Let's go ahead and face the lost expedition. The work shift Can I just build a really fast... Gathering post? I can. The thing is, as soon as that runs out, I'm in a little bit of a pickle. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and get a coal thumper. This is probably going to hurt me, isn't it? If I do this, can I turn it off without any consequences? No, these don't work. What if I just heat these up? That works. 
That also works. Okay. So that should save up some stuff, right? Mild false bite. Food hothouse. Let's go ahead and build this one. Let's build it here. Yeah, I know it takes steam calls. Steam calls. We have just used our first steam calls. Steam calls are necessary com uh, component in advanced technology. We can't manufacture steam calls in the city, so let's hope that our scouts find them during expeditions. Let's hope they do indeed. Let's hope I can also get coal thumpers going before it's too late. First of all, people made camp here. Too exhausted to go on. We should escort them to the city. I'm gonna send them. Survivors will set out towards the city on their own. It will take longer and some of them may die. Just send them. Uh, just send them. It's fine. What about this? What does this say? The particular building must be the Arc uh, Royal Society built to investigate the eternal winter. There's smoke all over it. And this is sturdy shelter. Um, a bulky cylindrical construction stands on this small hill. The Union Jack flies over it, but there's no sign of movement. This one is closer by, so let's take that one. Heating is off, the generator is down. That's okay. I will manage. Let's get the hot house going and let's make the kids work in there. Angry about the cold. I won't address this or this greatly. And keep them heated for how how I want to address this right now. How bad is my discontent going to be? Okay, that's actually not too bad. It's okay. <laughs> it seems worse than it is. Let's go with purpose. Uh, let's pick... New ability, evening prayers, house of prayer, temple, each of the race of hope, and has a small chance of convincing the Londoners to stay. Uh, shrines, shrines, shrines for people working nearby, shrines increase efficiency in nearby workplaces. You will have to build three shrines. Let's go ahead and do this one. Listen, everyone. New law is signed. Let's go ahead and build another workshop. And don't worry, I know that uh, I'm in trouble if I do all the other stuff, but I, I need to get this done as fast as possible if I want to have enough coal to survive. To have this on too. 12 hours only. Well. Actually, wait, I can, I can fix this. I can fix this. I don't think you need this, and I don't think you need this. Uh, what do I have on that doesn't need it? You don't need it. You need it because you're out there. Um, everything else doesn't seem to need it. Oh, you do need it. How is healing going, by the way? Can I do this and not really have to worry? Sort of. London has gained more followers. Great. I have to do this just to make sure they don't, like, die. <laughs> just, just to prevent death, you know? Scouts have reached the observatory. Okay, what do they have? Survivors. Something is amiss about the observatory. Snow covers the precious instruments and the dome is open, letting out the thin column of smoke. Someone's inside. Um, instead of astronomers, we are met by some of our lost people. They explained that they came here for help, but found everybody dead. The astronomers continued their observation until they starved. They were, what was so important for them, they wrote it up to their diaries. The laws of sunlight can't be explained solely by the fouling of the atmosphere of the southern volcanoes. The sun is dimming. Well, isn't that, isn't that great? Descendants sent them to the city. I have other things I need to care of. Um... I will probably go to the Lost Expedition and then go to the shelter. Come on, research. There's no tomorrow, people. 
Research like this, no tomorrow. Don't I have more children to work? Oh, here's what's happening. Okay. Aid over there, make more food, please. Search for others. Our people found a trail leading into the wilderness. We should follow it. We must find other people and ask them for help to secure our survival. Search. Find another settlement. Build three houses of prayer. Uh, I think I'll build the, um, the houses of prayer now. Mostly because if I don't, it's going to hurt so much. Oh yeah, more homes and stuff to take care of that too. But that also means more people though. Uh, I need more people in here. More kids in here. Thank you. And then we need more people over here. And then we need more people to hunt as well here. And then we need more people to gather here to buy time. And then this is a medical post. Let's go ahead and put people in there. And let's go ahead and put an um, engineer in there as well. Cold Thumble Research. Okay, great. Go ahead and pull the Cold Thumper here, I think. Actually, I need it fairly close by. Let's put it here. Let's put another one here. Charcoal coal mining. Festa gathering could also be very useful. Bunk houses, though. More scouts. I actually want more scouts. Uh, I need more scouts for this. Mild frostbite. People can build those too. We don't need to gather this anymore. More scouts, please. Uh, I'll also go ahead and build this out of wood. We have an amputee. It's okay, though. We shall manage. Go ahead and do that one. And okay, let's do that one, too. Um, I hope it'll rise slightly. Night is coming. Put down your tools. Let's actually have you guys gather over there. So I'm surprised that cold is lasting that long. Um, let's feed them... Let's feed them and increase the food. Um, you have to feed everyone in stockpile 63. Let's stockpile some food. Let's hope that's it's possible in this situation. Oh, you're waiting. Um... Let's go ahead and get over here. Come on, get the coal going, get the coal going. Okay, great, great. Um, so you guys, don't you do this anymore? Go ahead and do this instead. Problem is there's a lot of children doing that. Go ahead and have the kids do this. Uh, you guys need to do this instead. Uh, can I have you go over here and you do this? Need the rest of the people to arrive soon. Let's build a gathering post here, right? Because I need it to gather both of these. 
where is it? It drops it. It drops it back here, correct? Let's build one here and see if it reaches both of them. How long do you last? Four hours? How long until six? Ooh, that's gonna be a bit, um, a bit meh. <laughs> they get more followers, of course they do. One hour left. We are now out of coal. Oh, I didn't realize we we're gonna... Oh boy. Wait, did we get more people now? Oh, we did. It just gave us more coal and we're already out again. You cannot be serious. I'm gonna have to find another alternative source if I can't straight up like get coal from this. need all of these to function so it would be great if I could get all of them to function at the same time while having enough to supply you know purpose this is very bad this is very very bad you're gonna have to break up protests um, they're gonna be super useful so I'm have to go hear with me, those guys New law in the city. How am I having trouble with people? That's the gathering. That's going to be useful right now. Um, you guys need to gather manually. Because if we don't, it's going to be bad. Maybe now I can turn this on? How is it looking if I turn it on? Okay, it looks okay. That is now okay. I'm gonna have to gather it manually for a little while. Uh, it does not... I don't think it reaches over on the other side here. Build a shrine for the Faith Keepers. Out here then, I suppose. And uh, what do I do now? What do I do now? I guess I get this one. I need to build more homes too, more areas for people. Needs to be some place that's somewhat hot too. That seems okay. Feed more people. We need to feed everyone. Uh, ask a cleric to uh, reassure the people. okay we, we'll we'll fix it maybe you're waiting oh i can't believe i keep missing that tilda is well supplied and built to withstand even the worst weather and advanced steam uh, protects it from the cold the trail leads to another city this shelter is comfortable and well equipped with emergency supplies there's no notice poster but a heavy run door to all scientists have used the supplies remember to notify the quartermaster when you return to the city this means there's another um, city out there a sign post by the trail points to two directions london 1934 miles home 327 miles Take the resources, it's food. I need this food and I need it now. 11 hours to arrive. How about this one? 
seven hours. Let's go ahead and get over here. I don't know if that helps with going back to the city, since we don't really know the way to the city, but... We can only dream. The re rebirth of faith. Sir, so people have started to visit the house of prayer. There aren't many of them yet, but it might start to become something special. It seems they really needed a proper place of worship. Yay! <laughs> Woohoo! It's great! How many people do I have free, by the way? Do we have a lot of the hunting things free? Like, are they straight up? We need more of them. I think we do. I'm gonna have to build another one here. Need another tent. But they're done over there. Okay, that's great. Uh, come back home with the supplies, please. We need to feed everyone. Before everyone dies. One of our people died. No, 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 don't die. People don't die. Stop it. Stop dying. It's illegal. The writing on the wall sent a cleric to reassure people. Did we build this? We did. Oh, prices. And this is another hunter's hut. How is it we not have enough food? Like, how do we not have enough food? How is that an operative? Oh, because it's not been built? Or is it because I need to build it? Oh, it needs to go... I see why it's not an... Why it's an operative? Um, let's go ahead and... Connect that. There we go. We're out of wood. We're always out of wood. We're always out of something. Get that faster gathering, please. There we go. It's perfect. We're probably going to have to do some coal mining. Yeah, we're going to have to do coal mining next. We need 20 wood. Come on, get some 20 wood, please. Okay, we're back again with, with food and stuff. Get to work. Move, people. There's plenty uh, get over to the sturdy shelter. 11 hours. Just go ahead and do it. Here I can get one worker free, I suppose. Two worker and make one engineer, and I don't want the ch children to work there. It's better than one person goes out than no one, I suppose. Zero still? What What is taking all the coal? Am I straight up not gathering enough? Coal mining, come on. We got this. That's a coal thingy over there. We can do it, we can do it. We just gotta keep going. We also gotta fight the Londoners at the same time. This is, this is tough. Alright, well, uh, that is also gonna be it for this uh, video. I guess we'll see how things go in the next one. If we are gonna have even more trouble, I suppose. Um, you never know. But I do hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, consider liking, subscribing, and sharing. Hope to see you in the next one. And as always, stay awesome.